Yeah, Bootsy. Bootsy, yeah. Bootsy, I've known for quite a while. Back in the day, you know, my band toured with Delight. Um, Bootsy was, Bootsy's band was the backing band of Delight yeah. and I got on really well with Bootsy, we became friends. Um, I made a record with Bootsy about 15, 20 years ago and it never really kind of came out as such. I just contacted him and said, do you want to do something? You And I told him this whole concept, even though the whole album was like a concept album, I had a concept for each track, you know, it was like, I treated them like separate pieces of work, but with a whole kind of idea of being like one piece of work. And I said, I've got this idea about doing a track about my favorite building, which is the Atomium in Brussels, which I'm slightly obsessed by. And I, and I was a bit of a train spotter spending two days I, do, I spent two days at the Atomium in Brussels, <laughs> going up it, sitting outside, had lunch, looking at it. Taking photos. Up it, walked around it, went to the gift shop, went back up. I just love the way it looks sitting on the piece of land that it's on. It's just, it's, if you've never been, it's one of the most amazing experiences. And I told this story to, to Bootsy, and, and then Bootsy kind of laughed, saying about, you know, because you know, it's kind of like the mothership, which is a very P funk thing. Yeah. And, you know, and he's taking it to another level about it being the mothership. I, I mean, you have to listen to lyrics yourself. I won't, I won't give too much away, but it's, it's, it's a really fantastic. Uh, Lyrically and vocally, it's amazing. Another artist I love is David McCormick. One of the most unique, talking of unique personalities, the voice. Where does it come from? Yeah. David, it's David's, just incredible, isn't it? David's one of, I, I swear to God, David is, to me, is one of the best singers that this country's produced. Yeah. yeah he's, he's, he's phenomenal. You know, he sits, he comes up and sits in my flat and be working music and he opens his mouth and you just kind of go I hate you it's otherworldly <laughs> it's, it's like, like I would I would give him the left theme. leg to be able to have that come out of my mouth when I sing because being a singer in a band all those years you just think wow it's just fluid it's just that idea you know for some singers it, it takes a bit of an effort to do that but for some people they just they just have that natural born talent of just being be beautiful with a voice quite a spiritual voice oh, as well. yeah, it really moves you doesn't it like Josephine Baker's kind of quite a kind of cool story that he um, he kind of came up with the idea of Josephine Baker being the you know the female black dancer and the idea of like the first female astronaut black first black female astronaut um f phoning down to nasa when she was weightless and says oh look i can gyrate like josephine baker so that's kind of what the whole song's based on right okay once again i won't give too much away because yeah because when you listen to the song and you start discovering the lyrics you'll get the storyline which is really great <laughs> <laughs> 